The seven teachings are love, honesty, humility, truth, wisdom, respect, and bravery. Achieve honesty within yourself. Recognize who and what you are, a child of grandfather's spirit. Do this and you can be honest with all others. Tell the truth even if you don't get what you want. Humility. Don't be too proud of yourself and your abilities. Realize you know very little of all the universe. Have a modest view of your importance. Let go of your ego and its needs. Truth. Truth is what people want, but sometimes don't want to hear because it hurts. Truth can be our companion. Learn and listen to truth, live with truth, walk with truth, and speak with truth. Wisdom. Know the difference between right and wrong. Know what we say and what we do affects others. To cherish knowledge is a part of wisdom. To trust the Great Spirit is the beginning of wisdom. Love. Love must be unconditional. Everybody needs love, especially the weak. If one cannot love oneself, it is impossible to love anyone else. Love is larger than any of us. As we connect to it, we are gifted with the ability to love. Respect. To honor is to have respect. We must respect all people and all of creation. To get respect, you must give respect. When you know you are loved, you can give respect. Bravery. Do what is right, even when the consequences are unpleasant. Face the foe with integrity, whether it's a bad mood or an angry person. Bravery is the state of having a fearless heart. These seven teachings are represented by animals who reflect our connection to nature and our connection to the land. The spirituality of our people is deeply rooted and connected to the land. You cannot live on this land honoring all that there is on the land unless you understand these seven laws. If we do not understand these teachings we, that we are inspired to live by, then there is a good chance that we will be disconnected. If we live by them, we will have happiness, peace, and live in harmony.